So guys, it's your boy Asad looking for your jobs here in uh, Galo, Galo, this Galo, Galo Mall. Galo Mall. In Francis. In Francis Town. Wow, that's really nice. So our question of today is, uh, what's your name? Kamkhelo Ramashaba. My name, Kamkhelo. Kamkhelo. Damn, that's really hard. Yeah, it's. What language is that? No, Kamkhelo Ramashaba. Let me say Kam. Gam. Gam. Oh, nice. Let me call you Gam. Mm. So our question of today is if someone finds himself or herself in this city of Francis Town, how is it how is it easy to survive here? Uh well uh in Francis Town it's not easy. It's not easy. It's, really? it's not easy. Yeah. Which kind of jobs may be available around? Okay, it's okay, it's okay. Hello? Uh hi. Hi everyone. Mm-hmm. You are talking to Kamakailo Ramashawa <laughs> okay. in Francis Town. Yeah. I'm working in Galo. Yeah. My shop is here, uh, one stop or two style. Okay. Yeah, that's where I'm working. Okay. So, yeah. What kind of j- jobs are available in this city, maybe, if someone is coming to look for a job? Uh, in Francis Town, I'm not really, really sure about it, but to find a job is not easy. For real? Yeah. Yeah, you can find a job, yes, if you know someone. It's connections. Yeah, connections. <laughs> yeah, that's why it's easy. Okay. You, you get my point. It's about who you know, not what yeah, you know. Yeah, okay? I think so. I think. So if you get employed, maybe what's the minimum pay? The minimum minimum pay. Mm. It's uh ah it's it's uh depend on the job you are working. Like the minimum is for any job, maybe if you get employed. Like so you mean the salary? Yeah, salary. Minimum. Like here, I'm working here. The salary starts with 1.5. 1.5. Yeah. That's 1,500. Mm. Like, mm. That's like uh, 120 dollars. Yeah. Uh, and over times. Yeah. Can that sustain someone in the French system? The the what? Like you can manage to pay rent, water. It's not easy. Movies. It's not easy unless you are having someone who can help you. Okay. But if I'm working here, I'm renting. Let me say 1.5. Mm. And then 500 is over time, is how much? 2000. 2000. Yeah. Rent is 1000. Food, I have to buy food. Okay. Yeah, you, you get the point. Wow. Yeah. That's really hectic. Man. Yeah, it's hectic. It's, wow. it's not easy. Hey. Wow. So, mm. do you advise maybe people from other places they should come here? Or? Ah, I doubt. Because hey, it's not easy. You know, if you are a foreigner and then you come in Botswana, mm. Mm. you look for a job, it's not easy. And one thing that I'm upset about it is yeah. we are all Africans and you're calling me a foreigner. <laughs> <laughs> how, how is that? <laughs> okay, Yo. well, thank you so much for your yeah, time. Okay, it you're was welcome. great talking to you. Yeah, you're, you're welcome. I'm Asad, what's your name? My name is Jeff. Jeff, uh, you live here in Francistown? I live here in Francistown. I work here in Galo. Wow, that's mm. really nice. This is Galo Mall, by the this way, This is right? Galo Mall, yeah. Okay, so my question of today is, if someone of, uh, finds himself or herself in this city of uh, Francistown, how easy it is to survive here? Uh, actually, my friend, uh, hey, in here in Francistown. Yeah. Hey. Maybe the kind of jobs available are easy to get. Yeah, they are available, but no, not so much. Okay. In fact, here in Francistown, actually, well, these these guys Chinese. Chinese. They are now they are the oh, many they are, they, are, they, are, they are the ones who are pro- producing better jobs. Okay. So that you, maybe you can survive contracts, whatever it is, shops, whatever it is. Okay. So what's the minimum pay maybe in this city? The payment. The minimum payment, yeah. Ah, uh, in, uh, in these Chinese, some of them 1.5, 1.2, just depend how you work. Okay, oh, 1.5 uh, pula, right? 1.5. That's pula. like um, 120 dollars a month. A month. Wow. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so can someone survive with such kind of amount here? Hi, my friend. Hi. Can't survive. <laughs> it just depends how you work and how you you survive. Yeah, Otherwise, yeah, you just how is housing here around? Housing. How is it, how expensive is the housing around? Yeah, I mean, rental rental is too high, but it's better than jobs. Okay. You'll find that I'm renting a house with um, electricity, water, with, with five hundred, some of them four hundred okay. per month. Okay. You see, that's when you can survive. Oh, okay. Mm. Wow, that's really nice. Thank you so much for. Thank you, Pat. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. Oh, okay, okay.
So guys, it's your boy Asadi looking for your jobs here inside of Gola Mall, right? No. This is Go? Galo Mall. Oh. Galo Mall, yes. Yeah. Oh, what, I'm, I'm Asadi, what's your name? My name is Komoto. Ko? Komoto. Komoto. Yes. Ish, your names, man. <laughs> comfort, meaning comfort. Oh, comfort. Oh, yes. Wow. Nice, very nice. So our question of today is, if someone uh, finds himself or herself in this city of fancy town, how can they survive? Like, which kind of jobs are easy to get here? Uh, there are plenty of jobs, especially, I would say, entrepreneurship. Okay. You can opt for entrepreneurship because nowadays there are no jobs. So you can uh, try maybe selling, selling something, selling clothes. Okay. Yes, that's how we survive here. Oh, wow, that's really nice. Like, if you get employed here, what's the minimum pay maybe around? Um, I would say 3000 That's the minimum pay. Okay, that's how much they pay? Ah, uh, <laughs> That's almost mean, $250 per month. Yes, that's almost $250 a month. Uh, what, do you, what are you required to have maybe to get that job? Um, you have to know how to talk with customers. You have to be confident. Okay. That's all. So anyone can get it and it doesn't matter where they come from? Yes, anyone can get it. It doesn't matter where you come from. Thank you so much for your information. You're welcome. Okay. My name is Asad, what's your name? My name is Sam. Okay. Yeah. You live in this area of Francis Town? I live in Francis Town. Okay. I come from Tutume. Tutume, yeah. that's in Botswana still? Yeah. Oh, okay, good. So our question is, uh, how hard is it to survive in Francis Town? Uh, we, we survive, but yes, it's too hard to hustle. Hustle is, is not uh, simple like uh, another country like uh, okay. South Africa. Yeah, South Africa is so good just because you can hustle, the job is okay. Okay. Yeah, but you yeah. can find you to 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 to, to the carpenters or for what for big to come. Money. Mm, yeah. money. So, uh, which kind of jobs are available maybe here? If someone uh, finds himself or herself in this area, what are the easiest jobs to get? Two? Easiest jobs to get? Jobs to get? Yeah. To get uh, employed maybe? Employed, yes. You know what? Uh. Employed to... Uh, it's, not, it's, not, it's, it's not simple to... To get. To get it. Just because nowadays the... the, the, the you know what the, the people they use it to uh, to 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 self themselves to give the, the job you see oh yeah we yeah. employ themselves yeah they employ themselves oh okay so yeah. uh, how what sh how how much is the maximum or the minimum pay here maybe if you get employed uh, the maximum is less that's because the the the, the, the money is less than 2000 pula for for, for, for if you need employee. Oh, uh, monthly. Monthly. Oh, wow. Thank you so much for your information. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, bye. So, my name is Asa. What's your name? Uh, my name is <laughs> Unami Masa. Who? Unami Masa. Unami Masa. Mm. So, you live in Francis Town? Yeah. So, my question of today is uh, whenever someone finds himself or herself in this city of Francis Town, which kind of jobs are available? Maybe they can do for a survival. Mm, that's what look jobs in um, Chopis, China's. Yeah. So there are jobs here in this area? Yeah, there are a few, few, but not few. More, yeah, few jobs. Okay, what's the minimum pay? Maybe how much do they pay every month? 1.5. 1.5, 1.6, yeah. Oh, okay, that's like $120. Yeah. That, that can help someone to survive in this area, like pay bills? Yeah, you can just pay bills or rent, everything, yeah. Oh, how expensive is the housing here, man? Mm, 500. That's yeah, what, 500. single room? Yeah, single room. It's cost 500. Oh, you, you find like kitchen and everything inside? And no, 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 just one room. room. Oh, yeah. oh, single room. Oh. Like everything is outside? Yeah, uh, everything is outside, yeah. Oh, wow. Thank, Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Okay. Well, is Asad, what's your name? Tepiu. Tepiu? Tepiu, Oh, okay. You live here in Francis Town. Yes. Okay. So my question of today is: If someone finds himself or herself in this city, how is it easy to survive here? Maybe the easiest jobs to get or something. How is life here in Francis Town? Ah, uh, only shops in shops. shops. See, mm. Employment. Yeah, employment. So how much maybe they they pay? Like the minimum pay here around is how much? 1.5. 1.5. Mm. 
1.5 that's like um, 12 13 like 120 dollars <laughs> isn't it <laughs> okay thank you for your time <laughs> so my name is Asa Dosene my name is Umpimes Temba Umpimes Kemba Temba Temba mm. oh wow you live here in France now yeah Oh, nice. So saying Yebo is like yes. Yes. Oh, in, in which language? Yebo. It's potok, like Tare Shona. Shona. Shona, mm. that's from Zimbabwe. Yeah. Oh, okay. You live here? Yes. So our question is if someone finds himself or herself in this city of um, Francis Town, which kind of jobs they can get to make their survival? Um, he can do like hustling, like do his own job. All jobs. By selling some perfumes and some of things. That's like employing yourself, right? Yeah, employing yourself. Well, how much do you need to employ yourself here? Ah, 20,000. Pula? Yeah. That's a lot. Yeah. Maybe someone I don't have anything. He can, he can use 1.5, maybe it's fine. But things are expensive now, okay? Okay. Yeah. So what kind of business maybe they can start which really pays well here? as well like, mm. uh, give gives a good profit selling maguinya ma fresh what is that maguinya oh uh, fat cakes cakes oh okay fat cakes and ma fresh fresh chips okay yeah oh that's very and easy to food, do yeah and it pays here yeah. yeah wow thank you so much man for your time okay thank you so guys at this mall is where you find almost a lot of people comes here and it's very early in the morning. You really can't tell what um, they go, come to get their services here, you know. And I'm really wondering that they have expensive vehicles running around, you know. You guys, thank you so much. Would you mind if I ask you a question for my YouTube channel? Yes. Okay. Uh, I'm Hamza, what's your name? Like your job. Oh, you, hey, your names, man, are very hard to pronounce. Lucky. Ah, Lucky. Lucky. Yes. Oh, you from here in Francis Town? No, I'm from Mahalab. Harare. Mahalab. Mahalab. Yeah. It's here in Botswana here? Yeah. Okay, nice. So, my question is, if someone finds himself or herself in this city of uh, Francis Town, which kind of jobs do you think are easy to get here, which are available? Maybe anyone can do to survive? Uh, with, are they, are they, with education or... You mean any job or? Any job, maybe. Normal jobs to get. Ah, I don't have jobs here. That's why we are taking photos, you know. Oh, you are a photographer? Photographer. I'm also a photographer, bro. Okay. Uh, so you take photos for a living? Yeah, for. No, it's for a living because yes, you are still here, parent, using this, this man, you know. Oh, okay. So how much do you charge for one photo, maybe? Uh, one pick is five pool. Five pool? Yeah. It's like oh, how yes. much dollars? Ah, uh, five pool. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Thank you for your time, man. Sure, sure. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So um, you just had yourself. This is the most expensive city in Africa. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you. You know. Um, uh, I'm gonna work in the city. You know. Francis Town is really amazing. Damn. It's like I'm in the Europe. <laughs> Something like Europe, U.S. Like. Look, it's like South Africa in a way, you know. Um, my microphone has been misbehaving. That's why I'm holding it to get a clear um, voice. So I'm going to go in the street and ask to. So guys, here he comes one of uh, the other mall found in this area. It's called uh, um, Northgate Mall. Northgate Mall. So, one thing I've heard about people complaining around is Chinese are really taking over this place. So, same complaint in Zambia, same complaint in, um, in Zimbabwe almost. And now, in Botswana, like the first town to enter, like in Francis town, they are also complaining about Chinese. And um, when I entered here, the first impression that I had, I, I show something co uh, written, uh, Chinese Chinese shop if I'm not wrong yeah like they even proud like writing Chinese shop inside the city of, of Botswana so like this is the Northgate Mall Northgate Mall but let me tell you this 
this country has money. Like people, the vehicles people drive, like you can really tell from what they drive and everything, you know. So I guess I'm enjoying the touring around, and um, you know, I'm gonna have to go to look for something to eat, take some rest, and uh, we do it tomorrow.